Tuesdays, we get you caught up on all things technology. And joining us today, as usual, Keith Atchison, Fusion Interactive Group. And today we're going to talk about social media. It is something that so many of us are on. A lot of people don't necessarily understand how to make it work best for them, protect their privacy, which is a big concern for a lot of people. So let's tackle them one by one. Let's tackle them, Keith, today, starting with the, the biggest one, Facebook. All right, let's do it. All right. That sounds good. Settings that you don't know necessarily are there. You've heard about the privacy settings, but perhaps right. you've never explored enough to figure out a, where they are, and B, how to use them. Well, the good news is there's this new, or it's not new, but it's a, a recently created website that Facebook put out. It's called Facebook Privacy uh, Basics, you mm -hmm. know, and, and you can find out anything on there about uh, settings that you can, you can change for the content that you're posting, the content that you're seeing, all, all sorts of different things. Yeah, who there. can yeah. see what you're putting up there and, right. and how you can control. Because you may not be friends with somebody who can still see your, your posts. We, we all get those uh, friend requests, you know, where we're like, okay, well, we'll, we'll friend, yep. you know, but we may not want to necessarily see what they're posting, or you may have someone who likes Facebook a little too much and it kind of saturates your news feed, <laughs> too much, right? Yep. So uh, you, can ch you can control all of that, all those settings uh, in your Facebook privacy uh, settings. And real quick, people are posting videos all the time, it seems now, sharing yeah those videos there is something you can do to make sure they don't play right away and that'll kill your phone battery if you're if you're looking online yeah late last year uh, you know Facebook changed the way that the videos are displaying in your news feed yep. and uh, you'll notice if you mouse over them or if you even get close to them now they just start playing and the idea is that they want you to click on them and when watch and you know see the whole video you if if that's annoying to you you can change that in, in one of these settings in that website that we talked about shows you how to do that all right let's yeah. move over to Twitter right now okay. uh, Again, they have made a few changes, some subtle, some not quite as subtle, direct messaging, and right. the, the ability to share tweets directly. Absolutely, yeah. The, the, uh, very similar to the, the Facebook privacy, uh, private messaging, rather. Uh, the Twitter has direct messaging yeah. now. So you, know, you, you do a little search for the person that you want to send a message to. You'll notice over there underneath the profile, uh, it gives you the option to direct message them. Uh, and on your on your cell phone too, you know, if you see a, a message or a tweet in your news feed or in your in your in your Twitter feed, you can sort of long uh, they, they call it the long tap uh, that that uh, message, and then you can share yep. it directly with somebody else. So. And and they've expanded their video and picture options as well, and they're going to do more right. coming soon. Yeah, there's there's a few uh, cool new things that are coming out in Twitter. Uh, may, maybe not necessarily new for the social media realm, but new for Twitter. <laughs> right. Uh, you can create your own video in Twitter, and uh, they're they're actually going to make it easier to. Uh, you know, get the, get the things that you really like that you're looking for in your Twitter feed as well. Um, so much stuff out there, it's hard to keep track of it all and know who to follow and all of that. Sort and of that's things. the most important thing. You're using it for you. You want to see what you want to see and not the, the other stuff that you may not find important. That's they're they're going to try to simplify that it. dashboard for us, hopefully. Right. So, yeah. Keith Atkinson, we'll talk about Instagram coming up in the next hour here on Good Morning Connecticut. And as always, we'll put more information for you online at WTNH.com.